This is Nick with Build Brothers Roofing, starting my inspection at 4420 Maya Pond Drive out here in La Mesa. We are on top of a lightweight concrete tile roof. We've got a ton of broken tiles on this roof, and you can see all the damage that has occurred from these broken tiles. So these are all cracked. I just pushed, pulled them down a little bit, and you can see how the underlayment is literally just crumbling in my fingertips at this point. Um, so this is a major concern that the homeowner should be having. This appears to be the original roof uh, on the home. The home's about 30 years old. Typical underlayment. It's gonna last about 25 years. Um, although when you have so many cracked tiles as this roof does, uh, the underlayment will not last as long as it should. And it definitely won't go past its expected life, uh, you know, life expectancy. So, you know, all again, we're looking at a lot of damage on this roof. Again, pulled more tiles down. You can see all the damage to the underlayment here. It's literally just crumbling through it um, to the decking. I'll work my way up here, but all of these are cracked completely. I pulled a couple on that section again, just to take a look at what the underlayment looks like. Um, you can see that the majority of the uh, the majority of the flashings and sealant along these penetrations has completely started to wear through. Um, all the sealant that was used, the oils have started to evaporate. Um, it's starting to crack, so now water moisture is going to be getting down those pipes every time it rains. Again, more broken tiles on this section. I'm not sure why there are so many broken tiles. My only guess would be that somebody's been, um, you know, walking on this roof over the years that didn't know how to walk on this lightweight tile. But all the water that's been getting through here has completely disintegrated the underlayment. Um, and, uh, and takes it to the point where, you know, it is going to need to be replaced. Again, more cracked tiles over here. Cracked tile over here. Looks like some of these tiles have been replaced, so I'm sure this isn't a new issue uh, for this property. And again, all of these tiles are damaged as well. So, again, just want to show what the condition of that underlayment is in. This stuff is literally just coming apart. And even the underlayment that is still, um, you know, not crumbling just from being exposed is also extremely brittle. You know, new, fresh underlayment is going to be thick. It's going to be very gritty, very, very granular to the touch. And this isn't there right now. Um, we have some solar panels on this roof. Now, they did want to go ahead and picture frame uh, this portion, which is a good sign. Uh, they went ahead and shingled it. I'm not sure why they didn't just redo the tile along this section. Um, that's what they should have done just to make it look a little nicer. But anyway, this roof is, you know, it is waterproof at this point. And the reason they did that is because of the fact that this is such a lightweight tile roof and it is very brittle. Um, but just based off of the condition of the roof, based off the amount of broken tiles and the amount of damage that has already occurred, you know, in my professional opinion, this roof should be replaced. Um, this roof is gonna start to deteriorate extremely quickly and the cost of the roof um, does not really compare to the cost of the interior damage that happens when this thing starts to go fast um, so in my professional opinion a lift and reset would be something that the homeowner should be looking into um, in all honesty I, I think that what they should do is go with a different tile on this roof um, or swap it out to a a shingle roof uh, we can go ahead and you know switch up the colors on this house really kind of make it pop uh, but the reason being is that you can see just how brittle this tile is so when my guys come up here to do the lift and reset where we lift all these tiles up we replace the underlayment we make it a brand new roof we then take the tiles and we install them right back on the roof well a lot of those tiles are gonna break uh, they're not gonna last the process because it is so lightweight um, and you're gonna end up having a roof that's you know completely jumbled up with a bunch of different bunch of different roofing tiles on it so um, you know I think the homeowner if they are gonna go with the new roof they should go with a new tile roof or if they want to save a little money we can go with a shingle roof um, or we can go with a presidential style roof which is a thicker more dimensional almost wood shake style shingle and I'll go over all those options with the homeowners um, but again just based off of the amount of broken tiles on this roof the damage that's been caused the age of the home the age of the roof itself all those combined um, I really think that the, the homeowner should be looking into replacing this roof so that they're not having to deal with this anymore that's it for my inspection